In the Deep South, we face a lot more challenges to storing grain than they do up in the upper Midwest. And that is because insects are cold-blooded, which means that their development is dependent on temperature. So the warmer it is, the faster they grow. And so we have to try to keep our grain as cool as we can. Uh, and with corn, that's fairly easy to do. But with wheat, it's going to be a challenge because we can't get our grain cooled down in, in summertime um, in, in a way that's going to um, discourage the development of insects. But the main way that they can manage insects in the upper Midwest is that most of the, the harvesting is happening towards August for wheat and September or October for corn. The nighttime temperatures are cool enough so they can cut on their aeration fans and get the grain temperature down below 60 degrees, at which point the insects can't grow. So even in, in here in the Deep South, we can, we can get our temperature down in our corn fairly soon, but our wheat is another story entirely. We're, we're going to have to be faced with the fact that in terms of temperature, these insects are going to have optimum temperature conditions to grow from the time we put the grain in the bin until probably late August.